Packerite is the most unusual trade shop that you've ever experienced because not only does it produce microflute sheets, and, and most people would just call that a sheet feeder. Well, Packerite goes beyond just being a sheet feeder. It's a sheet feeder plus trade finishing. 50% of what we do is turnkey projects to make other people more successful at what they do which is make packaging in certain arenas. We have a unique niche in the market with our microflute packaging. Um, it's a sort of like a corrugated packaging, but in a small retail packaging box. They need to be finished out. They need maybe a microflute package to go with their paperboard packager. Maybe they need a high graphic piece to go with their brown box. That's what we do is we round out other companies to make them more successful in what they do. Our MasterCut 2.1 is an expansion of our 145. There's a few key differences, but really the master cut, when you think about it in the corrugated world, it is unbelievable precision as far as print to cut registration. The power register actually reads the bar on the sheet or the register mark on the sheet, and then a plate will actually move the sheet to put it in register. It's print to cut registration. It's less than a 64th of an inch because it gives you the most accurate register that you can have. The next thing it can do is it can handle very large sheets. It's set up to handle 52 by 82 sheets. We have one job that we run, which was a one-up. Um, it, it made it more productive because we were able to make it a two-up. From 60,000 sheets to do the one-up to 30,000 sheets. Well. By the time we had half as much time on the isotrod, half as much time on the die cutter, and half as much time on the printing press, even though we still had the amount of, same amount of square footage and board, we cut the machine time down on printers, isotrod, and the cutter. That equates to better pricing overall for our customers. It has a very unique feeder system makes you not have to stop. It's got a pre-feeder section. So when we get into some of the heavier, the B's, the C's, uh, the E's, we can automatically pre-feed into the cutter, which means that we gain speed. What drove my decision is the precision in the cutting the speed in which we can maintain that precision, the throughput, and the footprint size so that we could continue to grow the company.